Hey, MacWarrior, welcome back to Open Place MacWarrior 5. We're, uh, February 3059, so we're moving along in the years. We've done pretty good pickups in, uh, Clan Salvage so far. We have the mechs to make a purely Clan, uh, Assault Mech, Assault Lance. Um, I've got a BLC up here in cold storage I haven't put together yet, and i got one here being finished, and I've got one up here somewhere there okay and the active that has been finished took it on the last uh, drop and I've got a Highlander somewhere up here that is a clan mech so the Nova Prime in my uh, active I got a couple adders over here I've been selling off the 55 tonners I just I have no need but I've got two clan uh, Orion ones two C variants. Um, altogether, I got five Orions total. Um, one over here in the uh, in the bay, somewhere. Anyhow, wondering what I'm going to get rid of to keep. There's the other Orion to keep him. Um, I'd like to get that one. Well, it's going to be the, the wolf, I think. We're just going to drop him over. Yeah, I'm not going to be using him. This is the one, the real, the only real grinner. And no, it's not. I've found it like three times so far for sale. I got him on the battlefield at least. That didn't strip him, did it? I don't think it did. No, it's got an XL Engine Clan. That is appears to be removable, so he might be back in play getting stripped. Yeah, the ones that aren't removable, I'll demonstrate real quick. See the adder, see the cross lines in it. I don't know if your resolution in YouTube is good enough to show that, but the engine core, armor, ferrule, double heat sink, clan, all that stuff, everything on the screen right there has a uh, slanted line going through it of a slightly darker color than the space color. And that tells me I cannot take them out. I have tried. You can't. You can't remove those items, even with a strip mech or one at a time. Um, so they're not removable. Maybe it's because it's an Omni mech. I don't know. Whereas the real Grinner is not an Omni mech. Although I've had other ones that don't have no, that stripped. That stripped. I stripped them myself, so they didn't have one in there. Okay. Enough said. We're at uh, two minutes, and I'm not shooting anything. I get antsy. We're in the Meacham system. We're going to look down here on Dalkeith, because look at that. Warzone contract, 80 difficulty, 360 ton against the clan. So that's that's some salvage. And up here is a bit, another good one, a battleground contract. Uh, Rassel Haig is a sponsor for it, and Rassel Haig likes me, so I get lots of uh, picks for that. And that's a 360, but that's a battleground. And battleground, if you've never played one before, a battleground is a war zone extremely hot. It's literally everything all at once coming at you. Um, okay, it's a lot more coming at you at once. It's not everything. And it's still slightly tempting because it's Russell Haig, and Russell Haig likes me. So I'm, I'm at a toss-up. It's also really close to the uh, where I'm at, and okay, I need 28 days for the Battle Master. I can always swap that out for something else, like the other Battle Master or the my Hero Mech one. Let's go do that. If I get creamed, I told you so. <laughs> One of the things I like about the late game is playing with a bunch of good mechs, ones that you put together the way you like to play or want your, your lance mates to play. And uh, they do their job. To demonstrate, this guy does his job.
and that's my normal 400-ton drive, or anything over 350. So, contracts. Keep your head in the game. Opa, keep your head in the game. 76 Battleground. What is that terrain? Trees and stuff. Dry lands, okay. Eight days, small area. Time of day is night. Visibility is good, which, okay, that's kind of counterintuitive. Be better if the weather was bad. That way I pick up more shares. But look at all, I can only get nine. 30 points. That is not going to net me a, alpha, a, a good mech. Certainly not an assault. Oi. I expected better. I really did. Okay, that makes me feel better. Well, everything is up, and the Black Knight gets to go up a little bit, I think. I mean, it's a good mech, but it's not my best mech. Even for him. I can do this. Or I can put him in an atlas. Hmm. He's exceptional in the BH. What's the weight look like? I lose two picks on the battlefield. You try to keep all your salvage that you can. We'll give him this one. And I'm 10 tons light. I want to test out the uh, Highlander. Oh no, he's low on something. So there's no ammo. I think I saw that before. Made a note and didn't do anything to fix it. I gotta check it out for real. For reals. No clan LRM? Oh, it's not a uh, Artemis. That's stupid. Okay. How many days is that going to be? And is it worth it? Okay. Ten days. We'll do it. If the tonnage is right. Hmm. I mean, I gotta get these guys experienced in the clan mix, otherwise I'm gonna be hurting when I drop them all at once, aren't I? Let me five tons off. That's good enough. Let's go. Wow, nine minutes. Haven't shot nothing. I'm not all that good at editing, but if I, if you get enough comments telling me to edit out some of the uh, mech, mech lab time, I'd be willing to do that. I can always just hit the pause button on recording, do my mech lab crap, and just record combat drops. But then the continuity's gone, and you wind up seeing a mech come in that you've never seen before, and you wonder where the hell I got that. I kind of prefer the continuity. You guys know I'm on the up and up. I play it the same way you have to.
This does not look like a dry lands with a bunch of trees on it. I'm going to need all hostels, repair grounds are in on the field. Mercenaries. Of course it is. I've only got one philosophy on these guys, it's kill them fast. Concentrate my mercenary lance on it and kill them. the damage down as much as possible by not shooting my own mech. Damn Zeus. Nope, wrong one, wrong one, wrong one. There we go. Check out my guys, they all look okay. Biggest issue with a uh, battleground is you never know when to use that uh, repair bay. You don't know when it's going to be over. Come running at us, <laughs> you're not going to like the outcome. Okie dokie. And the dropship. This way, folks, get out of the water. Big rock. More water. It's exactly what I just did. Shadow Hawk, what are you doing over there, buddy? Oh, I got guys trying to sneak around behind me. See that? And the dropship right was in front of me. I can hit him. I don't know if I'm hurting him though. Well. All right, enough of this mess. Get out of the water. We're still all okay. Mostly. Bunch more behind us. And a bunch more actives in front of us. 
Yeah, looks like it gets shallow this way, so. You get really slowed down in water. Let's get out. Stay out. I gotta lose some aggro here a little bit. at him. Well, you're a little jittery. Good. Follow me, folks. Repair bay time. Another, another drop ship? Yep. The most important part for repair bay usage is to get there and use it before you take structural damage because it will not repair that. No weapons, no structural. Get out of the way, pretty baby. This first one's mine. You're next because you're the most dinged up. If I can just get out of the repair bay, I'll go kill something. Got a dropship that's been hanging there. That's not a good sign, folks. Perfectly timed repair bay. Oh yeah, I got mercenaries on this too, didn't I? There we go. That is a double whammy. What's that, a dervish? Must be. Got a lot of them, I'll tell you that. 
Good Lord. One, two, three, four, five, six. And that's not even a clan. Oh, that must have been the uh, mercenaries. PLR 3M. 3049, so not a modern. Excuse me, not a modern one, but good enough. And I can't take it anyway. That's a overvalued uh, 31, I think. Well, maybe not. It is an assault map. Excuse me, got the hiccups all of a sudden here. Another Orion, don't need. Sometimes you just gotta bite the bullet and do it, don't you? ERLP, ER, yeah, okay. E, as long as they're E, I must want it, right? E with a C, there we go. Zero, I am done, and I can take back that medium laser for an energy. If it had a C after it, I would do it, but it does not. Lots of heat sinks on the field, done. Good weapons. Now I just got to get them a mech to use them on. Then maybe get rid of half my mechs and just play start again. Well, this should be easy. 12 days. Folks, I'd love to do it. I'm going to come here. But it will be the end of the episode. Uh, we'll take that on as my first mission for the next episode. I've got to save myself enough time to do the processing and editing and all that kind of good crap and get to bed at the same time because Opus like to do that. So I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode here in the uh, Dow Keith system with a very much looming... What was that? A war zone contract with the clan so I can take all their goodies away in the next episode of Opal Plays Mech Warrior 5. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I really appreciate it when you do that. It lets me know I'm doing something that you want to see or not want to see. And uh, that makes a difference to me. Um, unless you tell me to go out there and lose all my mechs, that's not going to happen. So, Opal's out. <laughs>